this video is another tutorial about how to use the zoom okay so the last time is um, I was able to teach you how to change your background how to change background uh, here in the near the video uh, icon here you just have to choose the here the choose virtual background and then you can change here whatever you like, like that and that or your video background okay so I told you how to do that one and then so with the video filters here video filters beside the virtual background okay you can change like that uh, your tone there or none if you prefer not to use any filters of your video or you can uh, have the additional background here <laughs> okay so you can use that one so whatever you like so I already told you how to do that and then also how to write on screen sharing screen for example i'm gonna use oh, i wasn't able to prepare okay here okay this is supposed to be my lesson later so this one is about i'm just gonna cover it now so they they didn't have to choose and click on the button so i told you how to write use this annotate here annotate and then use the text for them to write here on the boxes for example example of abstract noun okay wait i'm gonna here okay choose here abstract we have the flower and the fun so flower should be here in okay i'm gonna choose annotate here again so always uh, click this annotate icon here and then then use the text okay so for the flower so we have here you can write it under the concrete okay so you write here uh flower okay that's the one and here fun is here because abstract is things that you cannot touch smell or uh, see it okay so it's fun that's for example so that is how you're going to write on screen just click the annotate and use the text and then other features here and then for the spot one I already told this one last time in my tutorials and then this one for you to highlight all the things that you have written on your screen okay so what I'm going to teach you now is that uh, here how to enable also uh, to uh, enable writings on screen because if your students already know how to write how to write on screen all of them are writing anywhere here and there and then clicking everywhere this hard stuff here they're all clicking and drawing and making some stuff that will annoy everyone okay so so this is how to enable this one and not let your student write all those things on your screen because it will distract others those especially those who are very attentive in class and they, they are all writing anywhere okay so uh before doing that one so of course if you can see all this one writings from your students anywhere so just clear it all clear all drawings as you can see here and then uh, if you have something important that you've written here on your screen so do not clear all just clear viewers drawings okay so that just uh, their drawings will be deleted not all because if it's all including your writings here will be deleted so so how to uh, in disable uh, how to disable them not to write on the screen so before when when you're having your lesson okay disable this one so that they will not write anything on the screen and after that one if uh, if you want them to write on the screen that's the time you're going to enable so this one you have to uncheck this annotate and shared content okay if you're going to uncheck this one because this is all checked so you have to uncheck this one the annotate okay uncheck that one so they cannot write on the screen okay while, while you are writing on the screen and then after that one if uh, you're finished writing and then uh, if you want them to write on the screen just click this one again check this annotate okay so now they can write and then one thing is if they are so noisy when you're having your discussion Okay, if you're discussing something, explaining something, so they're so noisy, so uh, mute all of them and then unable this one. Okay, uncheck this, unmute themselves so that they cannot turn on their microphone. So you have to check this one, unmute. Okay, unmute themselves. So because if you are just um, me, sometimes I'm just unmuting one, one those who are very talkative okay, in the class, so I'm just unmuting. And then he's, he's able to turn on again his microphone. So uh, what I did is just... Uh, and check this one so that all of them cannot uh, unmute themselves so this one and then another thing here in the chat box okay the chat box here the chat okay so if you want them to write in the chat for me I'm, I'm using always this one because sometimes I'm asking them that what did I told you last time okay what was our lesson last time give me some words okay examples of that word so that uh, 
if they remember something, then they can write it in the on the chat. So I'm always uh, I I check this ones I so that they can write in the chat. But after that one, always uncheck this one. Always uncheck this one because they are uh, they are writing and they're talking and I don't understand especially uh, their language is Thai, so I cannot read Thai. So in order for them not to uh, write anything else in there, suggest so and check the chat box, okay? The chat box so that they cannot write anything. Only if you want them to write on the chat, that's the time you're going to uh, check that one. This is under in the security, okay? Always be in the security and share screen, okay? Always uncheck this one. Do not check this one because they, they can share their screen if you have to uh, check this one, okay? So after that one, always, always uh, check this out if it's checked or unchecked, okay? So maybe you are you are calling them and why are you not talking but you were able to uncheck this one so they cannot talk they cannot unmute themselves so that's it what else i'm going to teach okay here and for the for the emojis so here there are lots of features here you can click the more record and then you can record this one or reaction this one reaction is here as you can see there's a default here only six which is a raise hand, thumbs up, it's a smile, the heart, and everything. And then, if you want more, like if you want, okay, uh, animals, okay, like for example, you can just uh, move here. Then, if you want them, okay, uh, if you're done, you, you can choose many options from here because not always raise your hand or thumbs up. Okay, you can find something, so explore, explore, let them explore, okay, so that they, they will be also excited during your class, okay. Click the heart, uh, heart stuff there, heart, okay, so to appear on their screen and they will love it okay another one sharing the sound okay here also sometimes you forgot to share the sound example okay i'm gonna stop this sharing first i'm gonna share um, example for this one so types of nouns so if you are not going to share the sound they cannot hear it so do not forget to share the sound before sharing it on your screen here in the uh, icon here you have here share sound or optimize for video clip so you have here share the sound so that they can hear you okay or if you forgot that you already shared the screen then you forgot the sound so i just click here the more more and then here okay because this one is uh before you share you did not uh, check that one so you can you can click and share the sound while you are already sharing the screen so you will not uh, stop the screen and go enter again so here you can turn on the sound in this side so share sound okay so you can share the sound there and one thing also if you if your student is so noisy okay i have here like three okay so <clears throat> another one that is okay i'm gonna stop sharing first first so now i cannot um touch anything if i will not share the screen so here there are lots of features you have to explore all of it so that you can use this one during your your class okay don't forget to teach also your student how to do it especially changing background if they don't know how to do it or writing on the screen so make a short video for them and share it on their uh, screen okay and they can just follow like for me i did um, a short video record i record myself doing it and then they will just going to follow okay this one this is what i did okay so i teach them i share it to them okay i share it to them how to do a changing background and stuff like that okay they have to choose the background so while i'm sharing this one i'm, I'm also telling them oh, where to click like that okay so because they really wanted to change the background if they can see others are uh, having their backgrounds and teacher how to do it okay and me too sometimes i'm changing my background and they love they love it okay so now they are all resting this one i i share this one the screen how to write okay so they are just follow click the annotate and then the, like the how to write on screen and erase so I did it for them so that it's easy for them to to follow okay so they're very excited every time that I have my class so I'm sharing it to them that oh this one this is new set okay, you have to do and try this one okay so they're very excited if they know something different every day they just have to share to them how to do it because some of them they don't know how to do it so just teach them how to do it okay this is all about okay you can lock the meeting no one can enter okay here in the security if uh, if you don't like that because sometimes uh, other classes are entering okay especially if you know that you know that oh they're all present and then mm, you don't expect anyone to come anymore so uh lock your meeting okay so that's it just explore doing this one and then one thing also that uh, sometimes your microphone is not working why is it that oh even if it's not muted but still i cannot hear me because they cannot hear me maybe your 
make sure that um, make sure that your speakers are on, especially if you are using other camera. For example, I'm I'm using an extension camera because I don't like the camera of this of this uh, laptop because it's on the keyboard and it seems like uh, I'm you know I'm looking up because the camera of this Huawei laptop is uh, on this on the keyboard. So I I bought another one, a webcam, which uh, it's in front of me. Okay, so make sure if you're connected to that camera, make sure it's connected. So example, in general, I'm using this one. So you have to click this one, okay? So whatever you're using, a camera or extension camera, you have to click that one so that uh, it uh, the it will not, uh, you know, they can hear you. Because if you're not, you're not going to click this one, the sound will not come out to them. So they cannot hear. So make sure you selected the right microphone and the speaker, okay? So teach also your students because sometimes they're doing that one. What they're they're talking to you, you turn on your microphone and talk, but still they don't have the sound because maybe they click the incorrectly okay in choosing their microphone and the speaker so that's it and also your video so make sure uh, when you're using a general camera so you have to click this one or uh, using your new other camera for your you know in just your laptop camera so make sure you select that one okay for here in the participant okay i think no okay so just and also if you want to see their chat okay so just click the chat here and then you can write in here okay so it's easy for you to monitor who is writing in the chat who is responding what are you asking and letting them write in the chat so make sure you you click this one so that you can see all of them here writing and then so the participant if you don't like to see the participant just click the chat only just the chat okay just the chat and then if including the participants are there so you have to click also this one so you can see here on the side participants and they chat box okay but if only one okay just the participant okay you can just click all this one and if you want a record you can just click this one the record and of course the reaction i think that's it okay uh another one here in view okay speakers view if you want that uh, they can they can see you fully especially this one you have to clear the speaker view so they can see you in a big screen and then especially if you are teaching like pronunciation and you wanted to see how you speak the word okay how to pronounce this word so you have to put here you have to click this one speaker view or if it's in gallery view you can see all of them here you can see all the faces in here okay so you will you know you can see what are they doing during your class okay full screen like that immerse view okay so you can have like that one so there you are so just explore so i think that's all for today Thank you so much for watching and see you in my next videos for more tutorial. If you like this video, please drop a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much. Have a good day.